were killers of walk like Pistol Pete and Pappy Mason Gave the young boys admiration Prince from Queens and Fritz from Harlem Street legends, the drugs kept the hood from starving Pushing cars, Nicky Bars was the 70s my name is Courtney Young, um, I've been at Empire for about three and a half years now and I am one of the coach supervisors. So I started off uh, sort of youth work since I was about 18, 19. Um, I've always been involved in sort of youth work settings and, and things like that and I found that it really helped me. So it helped me personally so and I was able to relate to a lot of young people. Um, so yeah, that sort of piqued my interest. Yeah, so in the gym we've got a 20 week program um, where a young person will be referred uh, by sort of another organisation um, or by the NHS or by the police, um, parents and self referrals. Uh, they could be referred for loads of different reasons, so it could be sort of as low as self esteem or it could be sort of whether they're involved in drug and knife crime or behavioural problems um, and we sort of try and help through that and try and um, pick out some of the reasons why that might be and sort of help them find a different path. To be honest, I don't think young people will have a lot of options, to be honest. Um, we do a sort of boxing therapy programme where young people will come in um, and sort of talk about what's going on, but in a more therapeutic way. Um, and I know lo lots of young people wouldn't get on with the traditional therapy, you know. Sitting down in the four white walls and just sort of, they wouldn't engage with that. That seems like a daunting idea. So what we do in the gym, sort of really helps bring that emotion out. I think it's, I think it's massively important because um, without sort of these services, then young people lose their voice. Um, who else is out there to help the young people? Sort of, uh, if you go into the middle classes, um, they just don't want to know, you know? So it takes a lot of work from charities like us to be able to give young people that voice in a place that they feel safe and comfortable. My name is Keontae and I'm 15. It helps me relieve stress and it also builds my boxing skill. I learned to get my footwork better. It's also a good stress reliever, you know, just punching the bags. Sometimes I go in the ring with my friends, just have a little one to one. Um, get, you know, a roadman and that off the road and stop carrying and all that. My name's Sarah. Um, I've been working at Empire for nearly two years now. I'm, I'm a sports coach and a mentor. So I was looking for a job role that actually entailed my, my degree and didn't want to put it to waste and um, come across this job, working with young people, helping them. Um, so yeah, it was I ticked all the boxes. So I work in schools out in Gloucester. So what we offer the young people and the schools is a boxing programme um, alongside a mentoring programme. The impact that we have is massive. Um, I think the stats, the reports all speak for themselves. Um, you see a lot of change, not only within the young person, but also within their behaviours at home and at school. Also confidence, increasing physical fitness is massive. Um, but definitely the behaviour, the behaviour change once they've started attending our sessions, it just goes through the roof. They really start to switch on and um, yeah, they just, they just improve within themselves. Um, I think we offer probably the best programme that there is and probably the most effective. I don't think there's anything like what we deliver here at Empire. It's helped me quite a lot actually, so it's helped me give up smoking, it's helped me, I guess, just stay on track with certain things.